action. Okay, so uh, this is the more of the uh, crappier side of things here, which is kind of left over. Some bras, which are not really worth anything. Some dash covers. I've got some sort of um, 930 turbo front headlamp bucket covers, it looks like. I, I, I don't know if they're 930 or not. I can't tell just by looking at them. Uh, just some junk here. This is some old Mercedes stuff. Got these mirrors, replacement glass. Got a whole box of those. Uh, like a hundred posters. Um, down here, this is good stuff here. It's all brand new and rebuilt and or rebuilt alternators and voltage regulators. Look at this. Mmm, yummy. This stuff is no longer available from a long time ago. Uh, starters as well. We built a new, you know, 356 uh, generator here. A bunch of starters there. This is just a miscellaneous bunch of keychain stuff. It's not worth anything. Uh, glass, more of the glass over there. We have an AC hydraulic jack that was returned to us a long time ago because it got scrap because it got scratched on the way there. <laughs> They have to be perfect when they arrive because they're not going to get scratched in your garage. So we have to take it all the way back. Uh, but anyway, um, not that I'm bitter about any of that. Uh, here's a valve compressor tool. This one's actually really cool because you don't need an extra jig. Stick your valves in there and wind it down. Takes the valve, take, push the valve down, take the spring out, wind it back up. Genuine Porsche tool. Every young child needs one of these. That's going to be under the Christmas tree for... Little shiny if he doesn't, somebody doesn't buy all this stuff. Uh, 356 heater boxes. Uh, I've got a lifetime supply of these too, as well. We got two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. So um, here they are. This one looks like it's been through a lot, but it is still an OS, it's got a sticker on it. So it's been through a lot of li shelf life. Looks like it's been moved 25 times, but brand new. Old, new, old stock. Um, moon caps. All right. Somebody asked me about these, and I hadn't looked at them yet. So these are definitely replicas of some kind. I'm just looking for some markings on them to tell, you know, what era they came from or how good the quality was. So this stuff was all made and stored 20 years ago. So I'm thinking most of the stuff, even if it's not genuine, is not made in Asia. But I could be wrong. That's just my thoughts on it. So we have a whole box of those. And maybe I'll dive through them a little bit later on. Sorry. It's all right. On this side, we just put some random junk that's not really that bad. You know, a GM steering wheel of some kind, or a Range Rover or something like that. All right, you want to pause it? Mm -hmm. 